It, it is just heartbreaking. When you hear the stories, it's just like, oh my God. A grim look inside the pandemic in India, a country reaching global records in cases and running out of oxygen. We knew that this was possible, but no, I don't think anybody thought to this extent. Um, the pictures are devastating, the stories are devastating. The devastation hits home for Mandeep Kaur, a member of the Sikh temple in Oak Creek, who has family, friends, and employees in India now. What are the stories they're sharing? That a lot of the stuff that we're seeing in the media, the pictures, the videos that are coming through, that's the true picture on the ground. People can't get oxygen, they can't get beds, they can't get a simple supply that as a citizen you're entitled to. Even um, as cremations are taking place, yeah, the country's getting to a point where they're cremating people in large quantities. So you can't even leave in peace. You know, it's just, it's, it's heartbreaking. That heartbreak led CORE to join a nonprofit organization to send supplies nearly 8,000 miles away. She says the problem is getting supplies from here across borders. What we're doing is sending them from the UK. UK is the midpoint. So we're trying to consolidate them into UK and the UK will ship them. The group sent 200 oxygen concentrators Saturday. In Oak Creek, Courtney Sisk, WISN 12 News. To learn more about those efforts to send supply to India, go to this story on our website, WISN.com.